We're joined now by Bengals head coach Marvin Lewis. Coach, first of all, congratulations on Darquez Donard, a, a, a kid who was high on a lot of people's draft boards from everything reported. What did you see in particular that you think will help your club? Well, what you like about what Quez did at Michigan State is uh, he played in a very aggressive attacking defense. Uh, he was put in one-on-one -on -one coverage quite a bit, uh, press coverage, bump and run coverage. Uh, he does a nice job at the line of scrimmage, nice job with his hands and, and moving his feet. And then he's, when he gets around the receiver, he's got a great feel around the receiver. He's not cumbersome around the receiver. Hi, Coach. Uh, now, Denard did miss some time during his college years with injury, season-ending knee injury in 2010, time missed in 2011, did start every game last year. How did you factor his injury history into your decision to draft him? Well, I think his physical skills and what he did as far as his physical testing uh, showed that he came all the way back from his knee injury, and, uh, and that was important. Uh, the fact that he did play the entire season this past season and the things that he did in his testing, his speed and so forth, uh, he did a great job. He'll continue to get stronger and better, obviously, as you move further and further away from a knee injury. Coach, it wasn't unexpected, but we went as long as we've ever gone without a running back coming off the board. Why was Jeremy Hill the right fit for your scheme when you took him uh, in the second round? Well, I, I, he, you know, as Jeremy Hill is the running back in our scheme, he, we really felt like he was a very, uh, what's the word, versatile, I want to say. Uh, his skill set, everything he did there at LSU, we felt like really transferred and equated very closely to the things we want to do in our offensive football team here. Uh, he's a great downhill runner. He ran the power plays, the isolation plays, the things in their offense we want to run, as well as catching the football out of the backfield. Were you surprised at all that it took as long as it did for a running back to come off the board? Well, you, you do get surprised, but you, you don't, you know, it's hard to evaluate what other teams' needs are. Uh, we felt like we had some backs that we graded as second round players, and ironically, they all, went off, they all went off the board in the second round, one, two, three. So we really felt good and fortunate to, to draft the player we did when we picked him.